Jesus, oh, 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 hey, we go praise your name. We go praise your name forever and ever. Can you give somebody a high five? Jesus, so, Jesus, so, Jesus, so, Jesus, so, Jesus, so, Jesus, so, Jesus, so. Thank you, thank you. Jesus, we say thank you. 
in the name of Jesus, my God. Jesus, oh, Jesus, oh, hey, we go praise your name. Be ready to pray. Psalm 112, verse number one. God bless my team. The Alpha Army. We are in the oil city. Takrade. Hallelujah. Christian Restoration Church. God bless you, Dr. Emmanuel, for creating this great studio for us. God bless you. We are ready to blow into the spirit. And there shall be signs and wonders. Psalm 112. We go praise your name, Lord. Forever and ever. Jesus is solely responsible for the miracles. We will continue to give him praise. I decided to share some of my worship sessions in church with you. Keep enjoying it. You are about to pray. I don't only preach. Sometimes I zoom into worship. Psalm 112, keep sharing, keep sharing it. Psalm 112, verse number one. Praise ye the Lord. Blessed is the man that feared the Lord, that delighted greatly in his commandments. Verse two, his seed shall be mighty upon the earth. My God, my God. My God, this is what will characterize a man that fears the Lord. His seed shall be mighty. Your children will be nobles on the earth. Amen. His seed shall be mighty upon the earth. The generation of the righteous shall be blessed. Amen. I will not take God's word just like that. I receive it as my word. Amen. He said that such a man said, am I a righteous man? Yes, I am. And the Bible says that my seed shall be mighty upon the earth. Amen. And he said, my generation shall be blessed. Amen. My God, Amen. your children shall be blessed. Amen. I said, your children shall be blessed. Amen. First, I love the verse. He said, wealth and riches shall be in his house. <laughs> the man that fears the Lord. He said, wealth and riches shall be in his house. So if I prophesy that you will be rich, I, I have not missed it. I have not, I have not missed it. It's the heritage of the righteous. The Bible says, Health, wealth and riches shall be in his house. Your children shall be prominent. Amen. And number two, wealth and riches shall be in your house. Amen. Listen, we are going to break a curse today. Amen. All the people that, are, that keep on saying that, oh, my children will grow and come and take care of me. The Bible says that, number one, your children will be prominent. Number two, after they are prominent, what they will come and find in your house is wealth and riches. Yeah. The Bible says a good man liveth inheritance for his children's children. That means you are not growing for your child to come and take care of you. You are growing to live an inheritance for your children. You are about to pray a prophetic prayer. There are some of us, our mindset are already cleared. 
I will be poor for my child to come and take care of me. My God. The Bible says that wealth and riches shall be in our homes. And our children, after they are mighty, they will come back and inherit. Amen. Your life is taking a U-turn. I said, your life is taking a U-turn. Lift up this prayer loud and say, Father, Father, raise for me a godly and mighty children. In the name of Jesus. This is an, in, this is an intercession for your, your, for your seed and generation. Lord, raise for me. I always tell people that this thing you call you are training your children eh, is just a shadow of it. No, no man is able to train a child. It is God that takes over children. And then he makes them mighty and noble people. And God does not take over your children. Your king can do nothing. Your discipline at home can do nothing. You are going to pray that Lord take over my children and raise for me a godly and mighty children. Lift up your voice. Sabela, Sabela, 
for undeniable exploits. In the name of Jesus, lift up your voice. You are about to do things you never thought of. You are about to have things you never thought of. You are about to build a house you never thought of. You are about to get a car you never thought of. You are about to get a breakthrough you never thought of. You are about to operate in a gift of the spirit you never thought of. Jesus say Lord Jesus as I start the day lead me to greener pastures in the name of Jesus say Lord as I start the day lead me to greener pastures in the mighty name of Jesus this is your prayer if you are not sharing the link you are not doing well please share the link please share it just click it now just click it now and the lord is going to lead you to greener pastures shout it loud and say father, father as i start the day lead me to greener pastures in the name of jesus lift up your voice leading you where money is coming into your hands god is leading you where you will get a contract god is leading you where you will be favored god is leading you where you will be honored god is leading you where you will find your husband god is leading you where you will find your wife god is leading you where you will find a job Jesus, Amen. where 
wherever you are, you are looking for is deposited. May the Lord lead you there. Amen. Wherever who is who must help you in life is, may the Lord lead your path there. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. today you are locating your greener pastures. Amen. You are locating your greener pastures. Amen. And when you get there, may the Lord give you a space to lie down. Amen. May the Lord give you a space to lie down. Amen. May the Lord give you a space to lie down. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. I prophesy you will lie down in greener pastures. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. say, Father, Father, scatter my enemies before they execute their secret plans against me. In the name of Jesus, say, Father, scatter my enemies before they execute their secret plans against me. In the name of Jesus, lift up your voice. Lift up your voice before they move out to execute their secret plans. Scatter them. Scatter them. Scatter them. Confuse their thoughts. Confuse them right now. Scatter them. Anyone on his way to let me lose my job. Scatter them. Scatter them. Any meeting going on to let me lose a contract. Scatter that meeting. Scatter that meeting. My God. Scatter that meeting. Anyone planning to let you lose your ministry. We scatter their meeting. We scatter their meeting. My God. My God. My God. My God. Baba Bilo. Lekon Brede Koske. Liva Kempra Kortatai. Baba Bampa Panto Brede. Reketon Pelele de Swala. Bebomba Bilo. Lekon Kompreda. Mina Kompreda. Lesko Pabele Katai. The Lord is scattering them. The Lord is scattering them. The Lord is scattering them. They will not excel. They will not excel. They will not excel. They will not excel. Every conspiracy against your destiny. Every conspiracy against your future. Every conspiracy against your marriage. It will not stand. It will not stand. The Bio Messiah. So move you, body. Eradis Katawan. Eradis Katawan. Rakatawa. Bebamba. Bibia. Complicate. Tonga. Licomplicate. is not for you. Hey, anyone deciding to visit your head and to gossip and to say things to defame you. Lebo bom bom bim bim kum bradangua. Lum bem bum zeke kum brede. Re bom bem bim gele kum boha. Bebdan sura. Le bum bem bim in kam bum barakata. Ruske terebo. Be bom bem bim bim in zonga. Lo bim bem in kum breke tora. Let them fail. Let them fail. Let them fail. We scatter them. We scatter them wherever they are. We scatter them with confusion. We scatter them with confusion. Mahadaba Surya, Rakadaba Shire, Rakadaba Shire. In the name of Jesus, say, Father, Father by, revelation, by revelation, give me the hidden secrets of life. Give me the hidden secrets of life. In the name of Jesus, name of say, Father, Father by, revelation, by revelation, give me. The hidden, of life. Give me the hidden secrets of life. In the mighty name of Jesus, lift up your voice. Shakata la baraba, skapara katora bela. I receive the secret of life. I receive the secret of life. I receive the hidden secrets. Oh God, Dikobelis, Dikobelis, keep sharing the link, Dikobelis, Makula, Tuwe, Skopele, Tuwe, Vakambo, Kalabare, Satya, give me the hidden secrets of life. If you are in ministry, God, give me the secrets of ministry. If you are married, God, give me the secret of marriage. I, if you are in business, Lord, give me the secrets around the business that I run. Give me the secrets, Lord. Make all this. 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 Mahadelia. Vakeli Bakaya. Mahadebo. Papa. Papa. Jesus, I've 
told you this time that whilst we pray I will share some testimonies I have I have literally seen God repeating the testimonies and I've decided to fix some of them in the midst of the prayer so that as I read it you don't even have to pray something will happen to you my God God has done it oh Bishop God has done it my brother my big brother got married for eight years they tried for a child severally but to no avail he keeps dogs for pets so the persons in our community started calling him and my papa yeah. father of dogs even to his face unbeknown to him his very wife started spreading falsehood that my brother has fertility problems and is incapable of impregnating a woman and even if a woman takes seed for another man and gets intimate with my brother, that woman will miscarry. Oh, Jesus. This marriage is divorced. Now the testimony. My brother got a spouse to his new wife. And within a space of a year, she gets pregnant. But at the ninth month, birthing the child becomes a problem. So I made it a point to always mention my brother and his wife's name on this altar, including even the unborn child. This dawn, I joined Alpha Hour at 3 a.m., though I was late. But at the latter part, when Bishop, you were prophesying, you said there is a woman pregnant and is overdue. The child is unable to turn. My God. You declare the child will be birthed within three hours. <laughs> within three hours. I knew it was my brother's child in my, in my, in my sister-in-law's womb you are talking about. And he said, so I held on to it. As I prayed, I believed throughout the day. This evening, the miracle baby, the alpha altar baby is birthed out. <laughs> Look at that. He said, and God surprisingly gave us double to make our, uh, our hearts merry. He has compensated us for the lost years with a boy and a girl. Song and praise. He said their names are song and praise. <laughs> God of Alpha Hour has done it all. Let me fast for Bishop. God bless you, the family, and the men who pray in the background. My God. <laughs> I know God. You see, and I asked, he said, I asked, was the baby not positioned well in the night? Man? He said, yes, she wasn't. And the service had dilated only one, one instead of ten. Meanwhile, the pregnancy was ten months. So the woman was pregnant for 10 good months. Then her case was mentioned. And, and all that her brother-in-law did was to mention her name. If somebody mentions your name here, you are in trouble. You are in trouble. We are in trouble. My God. You are in trouble. My God. Somebody give Jesus some prayer. Hey! Look at this. Hello, Pastor. Hmm. This thing called Alpha Hour, eh? Hmm. It's not just Alpha Hour. It's actually God's hour of breakthrough. Ah, ah, ah. I joined this platform like three weeks ago. When I was going through my Facebook at dawn. I used to follow a certain Nigerian pastor, which I go to Facebook to listen. But the other time, I went to Facebook back, and the Holy Spirit directed me to you. And I was like, okay, then, let me follow, because I'm actually a young and upcoming pastor, and the Holy Spirit is training me. I don't want to go further, but the long story short was that, hmm, I faced a very deep financial crisis. And after I have connected to your altar, you were prophesying, and you said, a young man who has given offerings to a lot of churches, as in he's, he's a giver, and it seems he's not seeing anything. But God says he's meeting him soon. Yeah. Pastor, would you believe that hmm, me, that I wanted to get an Uber for work and pay? God has made a woman give me a car. After she suffered a lot of sickness, and God directed me to her, and she's got healed. The woman said, tomorrow God will, and I should go to Kaswe and meet the car. Pastor, this miracle has even over me. To be honest, I believe God. But when I got to Alpha Hour, I was getting fed up because I have given a lot of offerings and sacrifices. And there is nothing in the Bible I, I didn't try to obey by, by the help of the Holy Spirit. 
All I want to, all I want to say is that God is using you in your peak of grace. I have not reached there. Yeah. <laughs> we have just started. And anyone who will believe in the Holy Spirit and sow a seed in this prayer, believe me, even if it's a, it, it is a different world is believing God to create. I tell you by the mercy <laughs> The journey is not easy, but I pray by the help of God, I will always be used, be used as God is using you. I love you, sir. God. So I, I told you, so you have, you have a car now. He said, yes, I have, sir. Tomorrow I'm meeting the woman for the car. Ah. <laughs> hey, do you remember? I said, somebody, you have given offerings. And that same day, I, I think you have to look for the video. I, I said that somebody is looking for an Uber. An Uber car, and God is giving it. She, he didn't only get a Uber, God has dashed him a car. Wow. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Comenos Combrenes. Skadabaradas. Let me read this so we enter into prayer. My husband was always not. Can I prophesy? Yes. Anyone whose money has left you Jesus. into your church, Jesus. into the kingdom of God, Jesus. receive mind blowing testimonies. My husband was always not satisfied with me. He could look at me and tell me I looked ugly. And he didn't know how he ended up with me. Oh, Jesus. I always felt depressed and useless. At times, he gets so angry over the slightest thing. He once dragged me out on, me on the floor in an attempt to throw me out of my, our room because I wanted to pray and he wanted to sleep. Papa, small, small. After our prayers, no. Assistant near my He said, he is now handling me like egg. I am enjoying respect. And he joins me in Alpha Hour 2. Hey, hey. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> the man who, who was dragging you out of the room because you wanted to pray is now joining Alpha Hour. <laughs> Glory be to God. He has put my marital life in order. I can't thank God enough. God richly bless you and everything you stand for. He said, Papa, all the pressure to go and enlarge my butt hey, and hey. fix my breast. Hey, yeah, 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 yeah. Because, oh, don't laugh. <laughs> Somebody's testimony. Papa, all the pressure to go and enlarge my butt and fix my breast because they don't look the same after four children has stopped. Pastor, my husband craves for my body every day. At first, we can be in the same room for a month. And he hasn't looked my way. I can't even tell it all. I can't even tell it. All I am, all I'm, all I'm so, all. I am so grateful to God for what he has done for me. May you stand out as a unique person. Oh my God. I'm not only leading you in prayer, I'm leading you in worship. <laughs> we decided to play one of my worship sessions in church. Okay. God is blowing my mind. So there are some wives who have to go and work on their butt and breast for their husbands. God has handled it. He said, now he holds me like an egg. The person wanted to throw me away because I'm praying. It's now joining our hour. Sir, I salute you. <laughs> if you are praying, I salute you, sir. I love you. I love you for allowing yourself for God to use you to establish peace at home. I love you, sir. And every home that is in chaos, I prophesy, may the peace of the Lord visit that home. 
I said, may the peace of the Lord visit that home. Amen. I said, may the peace of the Lord visit that home. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We, will, we will continue the testimonies after our shout this loud and clear. Say, Father. Father. I stand in the gap for my family. I stand in the gap for my family. And I declare the name of Jesus. The that the family will not see distraction and humiliation. In the name of Jesus. You are standing in the gap. Declaring that your family will not see distraction and humiliation. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. My God. My God, my God, my God. Ita para fante la besa, le fana para, rekaya la para ba, pampele la, te compara la, rekaya la para ba, pampele la la la, rekaya la 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 la. My God, rekaya la ba, shampai la, rekaya la para ba, rekaya la para ba, makaya la para ba, belar, 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 te compara ba, shampai la, le compara. Stand in the gap. That devil must pass through me before the family can be destroyed. That devil must pass through me before anyone dies in the family. Rise up and pray. I stand in the gap. No distressing for my family. No humiliation for my family. I stand in the gap. Jesus, in the name of Jesus, shouting loud and clear by the power of the Holy Ghost, whatever I carry in my hand will not die, will not die, will not die. This is a prophetic word. Hold your hands, lift up your hands like you are holding something. Say, whatever I have in my hands, it will not die. It will not die. It will not die. In the name of Jesus, say, my business will not die. My marriage will not die. My education will not die. My profession will not die. My health will not die. Lift up your voice. You will not lose your children. You will not lose what is in your hands. You will not lose it. You will not lose it. You will not lose it. And the side chick trying to take your heart marriage will not.
They lose their peace today. They lose their peace today. They lose their peace today. In the name of Jesus. Pray your heart out. Listen, there are some of you, eh? It's just a signatory away. Somebody is sitting on it. There are some of you, a document, something must be released. A letter must be released. My God. Anybody sitting, anybody sitting, sitting on what must be released into your hands. Today, they lose their peace. Amen. By 4 a.m., they will start calling you. Amen. I said, by early in the morning, they will start calling you. Amen. Early in the morning. Today, somebody sent me a message. We prayed a prayer like that. Whoever must sign our letter, may God let the person sign. Yeah. He said, after that, the following morning, he went to work. He had, she had not received a salary for a long time because her head teacher must sign mm. the letter and the head teacher told her that I would never sign. Mm. I will never sign. Because of that, she has not received a salary all this while mm. until we raise that prayer, mm. that dawn. Mm. The, uh, he said, he said that, I will look for that testimony. He said, we went back to school the morning ah. and then the letter was presented. How come? He said, another friend told that when the head teacher came to school, mm. the first thing the head teacher asked was that, where is, where is Susu and Susu's letter? He said, um, can you let me have it? The, the, the head teacher signed it before he realized he had signed it. You are going to pray. Anybody that must release. Listen, it can be institution. It can be says, any, anybody that must release what must be in your hands. Today, they lose their peace. Early in the morning, they are releasing it. Lift up your voice. Like Say the link right now. Say the link right now. you are written an application letter and you don't hear from them lift up your voice and pray lift up. somebody send another I, I, the testimonies are plenty how he got an oil and gas company overnight you are going to shake systems and institutions you are going to shake I, I don't know why God is doing all these things but I tell you Immigration system will be shaken. Amen. Your documents will be released. Amen. Let institutions and systems Amen. favor me. Amen. Shout this loud and clear. Say, I shake up, I shake up. Systems, and institutions systems and institutions to my favor. To my favor. In, the In the name of Jesus. Even the government will be shaken up for your favor. Amen. Lift up your voice and begin to pray. Amen. My God. My God. Amen. Lift up your voice. Atmosphere, every atmosphere that 
Darkness loveth to hate us. In the name of Jesus. I was amazed that the Holy Ghost gave me this prayer topic again. Pray it. Pray it. Every atmosphere that turns lovers into haters, you are binding that atmosphere. People must love you for good. People must love you for a long time. If we're a pastor, pray it. If we're a business person, pray it. Customers will not come and feel like not coming again. You are going to lift up your voice that let, let my, my haters be turned to lovers. And let any atmosphere that turn lovers to haters be bound. In the name of Jesus, lift up your voice. <laughs> My God, my God, my God, my God. In the name of Jesus, shout this loud and clear. My life in circles are ending. My life in circles are ending. In the name of Jesus. Listen, some of you are only running in circles. You go and come back. You rise and fall. You rise and fall. It's in circles. You realize that you start, then end up the way you started. You are breaking that cycle. You are breaking that cycle. To, from today, you will move forward. I said, from today, you will move forward. From today, you will move forward. You will continually increase. You will continually increase. Our prophetic team for the year for Grace Mountain is extreme increase. I prophesy a stream increase over your life. I prophesy a stream increase over your life. I prophesy a stream increase over your life. South, I break cycles around my life. In the name of Jesus, 30 seconds, lift up your voice. Scalabarabash, Sakai Tabarabash, Sakalabalabalabalabalaba, Sakayanabarabarabalaba, Lakayanabarabarabalaba, Karabashampayanaba. In the name of Jesus, say, Father, bring peace to my home. In the name of Jesus. Don't think that your home is fine. Pray it. Pray it. If your home is scattering, pray this. If your home is fine, pray this. Pray, pray. Shout it loud and clear. Say, Father, Father bring peace to my home. Bring peace to my home. In the name of Jesus, yeah. lift up your voice. Jesus, your home will see peace. Amen. Your home will see peace. Amen. We declare the uniting power of God to visit your home. Amen. Every broken home is being amended Amen. by the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. We command husbands to come back home. Amen. We command wives to come back home. Amen. We command cases and issues to be settled Amen. by the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. we we bind the spirit of divorce. Amen. We bind the spirit of divorce. Amen. We bind the spirit of divorce. Amen. Hitting everyone, we bind it in the name of Jesus. Amen. This is your last prayer. Say, Father, Father bring, me into contact bring me into contact with the nobles and the prominent of the city. With the nobles and the prominent of the city. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. It's a good prayer. Yes. My God. May God, may God cause you mm. to encounter the right people. Amen. My God. My God. 
You will meet we smokers for them to teach you smoke. Amen. You will meet drunkards for them to teach you how to drink. Amen. You will meet people who introduce you to the uh, million dollar companies. Amen. Those are the people you will meet. Amen. You will meet prophets that by their spirit you also start prophesying. Amen. You will meet pastors who give you the secret to successful ministry. Amen. You are going to meet the nobles and the prominence of the town. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Shout it loud and clear. Say, Father, Father bring, me into bring me into contact with the nobles, with the nobles and the prominent. And the prominent. In, the In the name of Jesus, lift up your voice. Yeah. Sora. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. This year you will meet the right people. Amen. I said this year you will meet the right people. Amen. This year you will meet the right people. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. You will soon be listening to a powerful audio testimony. My God. I love Jesus. Are you ready, sir? Let's go. Good morning, sir. God has done it through. During a hour episode 16 prayer, you made mention of someone being delivered of stammering. To tell you the truth, I overslept and woke up at 2.40 a.m. Horse prayers had been done with. It did not stop me from catching up with what I missed. And to my amazed, my deliverance was awaiting me. And I heard you saying, there's someone, the Lord is telling me you are a stammerer, you are a stammerer, your healing is today, your healing is today. With my phone placed on my head, I jumped with joy and shouted, I received several times. I was not born with stammering, I learned it when I was about eight years old, not knowing what I was getting myself into. I feel away from public talks and programs because of the fear and shame of my predicament. And if I am being put on a program, I have to calm my nerves and cycle my mind and practice over and over so uh, I do not stammer. And my worst day was uh, my worst and unforgettable day was when a, a colleague at work told me that as for you, I know when you stammer, you are telling lies. I wept, I wept the whole day. In fact, I didn't sleep the whole night. <sighs> because uh, I didn't expect to hear that from her, from that particular friend, due to a cordial relationship I have with her. It hurts so much to know people don't take you serious when, when you're a stammerer, you know. That means in her mind, whatever I say and I start to stammer, that means I'm lying, and it, 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 it hurts so much, it really hurts. But now, by the grace and the altar of Alpha Hour, 
I can talk with confidence without any fear of stammering. I thank you so much. I thank you and your team. I thank you, Pastor Evers, and your prayer team for availing yourself to be used for the salvation of mankind. God Almighty bless and preserve you and your household forever. Thank you. Thanks so much. God bless you. And I thank God the Father, God the Son, God the Holy Spirit for such a great deliverance and healing. Alpha hour, every day with God is the greatest fulfillment. Thank you so much. God bless you. Amen. have that that video please let's see in the mighty name of jesus Amen. the lord is telling me there is somebody who has a stamina you are stamina your healing is today Amen. your healing is today Amen. and now the sister is healed ah, you, ah, ah. you know she first sent a message. Mm. I said, you said you were a mm. You couldn't talk. Mm. You are sending me. If you said you have healed, you are healed. Then send me an audio. <laughs> if I, the audio will be a proof mm. that indeed you have been healed. Yes. Then this is the audio she sent. Ah. Hey! We say to this God. Will you lift up your hands and give it? I'm about to speak into your life. Hey! God will do something for someone today. <laughs> Did you hear her? From the age of eight, it started. And people began to say that it's because she lies. That's why she she's tired. Let me speak over people. I, I don't know. Okay. Maybe this particular testimony to work a testimony for somebody. Good evening, Pastor Elvis. I have a testimony. I was praying with it. I was praying with you last two days. And after you prayed over a point of contact of what I'm about to pray right now. Hold your point of contact. I sprinkled some on my hair. Because I had addiction of pulling my hair <laughs> all the time, which has really destroyed my hair. And I've tried so much to stop, but with no avail. Anytime I'm there, at most in every one minute, I'm tempted to pull my hair. He said, I'm tempted to pull my, my hair out little by little, which has created a lot of space in, my, in between my hair, making my natural hair look ugly. And I didn't know what's wrong with me for doing all this all the time. So there are human beings who want to pull their hair yeah. from their body. Yeah. In fact, I have been stuck with this stupid addiction for, for years now. But just last two days, after sprinkling the water on my hair and praying to God to deliver me, I haven't done it again. Wow. Look, look at it. He said, I even wanted to wait for a while to see, but still haven't haven't attempted again and even forgot that I used to do that in Pope. Mm -hmm. Jesus is Lord. Ah. And I am grateful to God for this miraculous deliverance. People might not understand this testimony, mm -hmm. but I know how this has been embarrassing me. Mm -hmm. 
God bless you, Pastor Elvis, for allowing yourself to be used by God. Hallelujah, 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 Jesus is Lord. You know, these are some of the testimonies I want to. Because they are not, they are not common. When people are giving, yesterday somebody gave a testimony. He said that I'm even shy. I said, I'll read it. I'll read it. This, these are things that you may not understand. You are there and you are pulling your hair from your head. Every minute you want to pull. So he said he's, he does it little by little. Every minute. And for two days, it has not showed up. It's gone forever. Amen. I said, it's gone forever. Amen. It's gone forever. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Let me do this for the last. Let me speak over you. The testimonies are too much. Yes. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. What you have in your hands, I declare it blessed. Amen. You have a, an issue with one eye. Mm. Painful, red. You don't, there is no solution to it. Today, the solution has come. Amen. In the name of Jesus, be healed Amen. now. Amen. Be healed now. Amen. Be healed now. Amen. Be healed now. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. There is a police who are watching me. You have an issue. There is an issue. You are falling into a trouble. Jesus. You are scared for your life. You are falling into a trouble. The Lord is bringing you deliverance Amen. right now. The Lord is bringing you deliverance Amen. right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. You are a young man watching me. Jesus. You have a problem. You are, you are not able to sleep with women in the natural way. Mm. You always like their bottles. Mm. There is a problem. Mm. And you know it. You are frustrated. Mm. I prophesy your deliverance right now. Amen. I prophesy your deliverance right now. Amen. I prophesy your deliverance right Amen. now. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Every spirit that makes people run Jesus. into homosexuality, I bind it in the name of Jesus. Amen. I I bind it in the name of Jesus. I bind it in the name of Jesus. I deliver, I declare your deliverance right now. In the mighty name of Jesus. May the angels of the Lord open up your business. You are going to receive a record sales today. You are receiving a record sales today. In the mighty name of Jesus. If you have been waiting for your promotion, congratulations. 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 Congratulations in the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. Who am I seeing? I see your tongue. It is sword. It's sword. There is a sword on your tongue. It's not healing. It's not healing. I give it 23 hours. I dry up the sword. I dry up the sword in the mighty name of Jesus. I dry up the sword in the name of Jesus. There is somebody you have been set up. It's a trap. You will not. You will not stumble, but you will fall down. And when you fall down, you will never be strong again. They have set you up. I am just seeing you. Then suddenly I saw you fall without you stumbling on anything. I declare, let that trap, let that trap be destroyed by the power of the Holy Ghost. Let that trap be destroyed by the power of the Holy Ghost. In the mighty name of Jesus, there is somebody you are connected to MTN. You are connected there. I pray for an extreme favor for you. I pray for an extreme favor for you. I pray for an extreme favor for you. In the mighty in the name of Jesus, Amen. there is somebody you have a health condition. Anytime the snow starts falling, that condition becomes too tough. Today, 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 the healing God has visited you. The healing God has visited you. The healing God has visited you. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. what am I seeing? A mother, a woman, you are old, and your children are sitting before you. One is a daughter, he's a little older, and you are saying, Say, you're being a day. This are the words of the woman. God is coming through for you. God is coming through for you. For you to know you are the one. Your daughter is called a fear. A, a, a fear or a fear. That, that name. I declare God is coming through for you. God is coming through for you. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus. 
I declare you blessed. Amen. I declare you blessed. Amen. Your name shall be mentioned in the corridors of power. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. There is somebody looking for something from the government. Carry your blessing. 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 In the name of Jesus. I see a man at one side and a woman at one side and a child is in the middle. One is pulling the child to this side. Another is pulling the child to that side. What is this contention about a child? I pray in the name of Jesus. May the Lord settle this case with peace. May the Lord settle this case with peace. I beg you for the sake of the child. May peace prevail. For the sake of the child. May peace prevail. Father, give the man the wisdom of a father. And give the woman the wisdom of a mother. For the sake of the child, may they see peace as a necessity. In the mighty name of the Lord Jesus. I declare you blessed. I declare you blessed. What you have in your hands is for signs and for wonders. What you have in your hands is for signs and for wonders. What you have in your hands is for signs and wonders. You will testify over what you have in your hands. You will testify over what you have in your hands. You will testify over what you have in your hands. In the mighty name of Jesus. I declare you blessed. I declare you blessed. It's a 23 hour blessing. It's a 23 hour blessing. It's coming your way with speed. It's coming your way with speed. In the name of the Lord Jesus. There is somebody watching me. God said watch your tongue. Watch your tongue. Your tongue is stopping your miracle. Watch your tongue. You talk too much. You talk too much. You talk against people. You talk against people. You keep speaking against people. God is saying your testimonies would have come. But your mouth, your mouth, your mouth. May the Lord show you mercy. May the Lord show you mercy. May the Lord show you mercy. Amen. Never speak against your God. Amen. Never speak against God. Amen. This person, you just love to talk. When you feel bad, you start talking. When you feel bad, you start talking. You are spoken to speak against God Himself. May the Lord show you mercy. Amen. 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 In the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. There is somebody you don't know how it will be, but suddenly you will be called a celebrity. Amen. God is going to lift you. Amen. I don't know if you are into the entertainment field, but God is going to lift you. Amen. You shall be one of the top most celebrities Amen. in the mighty name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. Hey, Yakayada, Yakayada. There is somebody when you put your legs together, one is longer than the other. You put your legs together, one is longer. God is saying he's bringing equality. Amen. I command the shorter to grow up. Amen. I command the shorter to grow up. Amen. I command the shorter to grow up. Amen. In the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. I declare you blessed Amen. for you to have spent the first one hour with God. May you be honored today. Amen. No accident in your way, Amen. no death in your way, Amen. no calamity in your way. Amen. You are covered in the blood, Amen. you are covered in the blood, Amen. you are covered in the blood Amen. in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Hallelujah! Amen. Clap your hands and give Jesus glory. If you are listening to me, let me set this issue once and for all. I get so many messages. Pastor, I'm trying to give an offering. It's not coming. I'm trying. Please. We have given a lot of options. If one is not coming, choose the other one. There is a line. 0592 0592-7489-53. Combine it to the short code. I get too many messages and it sometimes get distracting. Please, I beg you. If God touches your heart, and it's not by force to give an offering. It's, it's, you are never on compulsion. God loves you and if he wants to answer your prayer, he will answer. If he wants to answer, he will answer. But we only give an offering in honor and say, God, I thank you for what you are doing and I thank you for what you'll be doing. So you are not under any pressure. But if you want to do it also, please, there are many options. Just capture the screen chat. There's a short code, star 77 states, uh, 100 hash, then uh, uh, an ID of 1757. 
That one is the best if we're in Ghana. All networks, we can use it. So that we cut off that stress. I beg you so much. God richly bless you. Anybody that gives, I decree to you over your life that the hand of the Lord will come upon you. Amen. You are honoring him with your substance. Amen. And may the God of 23 hour more ah. visit you with an unusual way. Amen. Visit you with an unusual way. Amen. Visit you with an unusual way. Amen. In Jesus mighty name. Amen. God richly bless you. Amen. Right now, today, when we live here, I'm expecting your testimonies. Amen. Please, if God does it, just send a message. God has done it all. And then, listen, all those people we are reading their testimonies, you have no idea how God is proud over them. Mm. And how God will keep working for them. Because they have openly praised the living God. Mm. Don't shout to God to work. And then when he works, you keep silent. Mm. Share the testimony. Let us also share for thousands to hear. And as they build their faith, you also, God will come back and honor you. I love you so, so much. We are in the oil city. Christian Restoration Church. If you are here and you want to have an encounter with us, tomorrow is my last night here. You can join us and then it's going to be a blessing. Hallelujah. And then my own Papa Nicholas date. Ah. Dr. Nicholas day. Today is your birthday. I love you, sir. Happy, happy, happy birthday. Happy, happy, happy birthday. We release a blessing over your life. Amen. We release a blessing over your life. Amen. We release a blessing over your life. Amen. In the name of the Lord Jesus. Amen. We honor you, sir. God richly bless you. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. I love you so much. Please let me see you. And as you leave the page, go and share the testimonies abroad and talk about Alpha Hour everywhere. God richly bless you. Amen. Amen. Who are hidden in free sorrow? Who are hidden in fatal? Got your own, got your own, yes, you say. Who are hidden in fatal? Who are hidden in free sorrow? Who are hidden in fatal? Got your own, yes, you say. Yeah, what's your
You are a great God. You 